Hello and welcome, I'm Alex and today I'm coming to you with a free tutorial, it will be page 4. Page number 4 is extensive and consists the side flap with two small pockets made of decorative paper. Inside this flap there is a pocket with oval cutout for a place uh, of photo to look like a passepartout. On the other side there is a small waterfall with decorated plates. Everything closes with a clasp. On the tunnel I glue a side flap measuring 18 and a half by 13 centimeters. From the inside on the flap I glue a pocket made of decorative paper to the size of this flap with an oval cutout in the middle. the tunnel, thus creating separate section. At first I thought about making a sweet tabs style clasp, but eventually uh, I decided on the single pointer clasp. Then 
I prepared mats for photos measuring knife and a half by nine and a half centimeters plus a small wing a one and a half centimeters that I cut out with a DEA and glue on the top. decorated with paper from the collection. Always remember to attach the tip to the paper with a stud before gluing uh, the paper to the tunnel. On the first mat and at the bottom of the card I attach a stud with a ring to make a string fastener. On the outside flap I made two pockets for photos by bending the decorative paper in the middle and cutting out two windows using a frame shaped DAA. I made two photo mats measuring 11 and a half by 8 and a half centimeters and finally I made a photo mat for photo 10 by 15 in the interior flap parts.
all for your attention. The tutorials are free, but only thanks to your activity I can develop my channel and make more videos. So if you like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up or add a comment. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, remember to do so. Bye!